Do not share your personal social media page with your coworkers, colleagues, or managers in the office. I don't care how cool you think they are, how well you get along, how much you like their vibe. Don't do it. Um, you want to be professional in the workplace and uh, having your personal uh, stories, having your personal uh, adventures, having your personal escapades uh, over the weekend, uh, having your colleagues have access to them can impact you at the job. You know, colleagues are very, very envious and extremely petty individuals, uh, unfortunately. So uh, they see you having a good time. They see that you purchase some new things. They're going to come to the office. They'll have questions. They're going to have uh, inquiries. They might be jealous. And then they're going to try to act on that. They're going to try to act on their jealousy and get some retribution. So uh, in life in general and in the, in the workplace, you want to ask yourself a question. If I do this, will it cause more problems or will it solve more problems? And if it's going to cause more problems, it's a simple solution. Just don't do it. I believe, this is just my conjecture, that uh, sharing your personal social media with your colleagues is going to cause more problems than it solves. And it's just that simple. So even if it doesn't cause problems, why take the risk? So um, don't do it. Don't think about doing it. It's, it's not really even worth it. Uh, you come there to do a job. Uh, you do your job well. You can find common ground to relate to your colleagues on. Uh, which is important in case you need a reference in the in the future. But um, other than that, you really don't need to share personal aspects of your life because it's only going to cloud your professional reputation. Um, and you know, uh, you know, people, you know, your, your coworkers are the biggest pocket watchers in your whole life, family too. But your coworkers are definitely counting your pockets, especially if you're black. They do not want you to make more or the same money as them. <clears throat> they can talk about <clears throat> uh, diversity. They can talk about uh, equality all they want to. They do not want you to make as much money and they definitely don't want you to make more money than them. And that's why the biggest, that's why they are the biggest pocket watchers. You pull up and a new ride, and a new vehicle, they're going to be asking all types of questions. If they don't ask you personally, they will have conversations amongst each other just about how much is Darnell pulling in? Because I know how much I'm making. And, you know, uh, Darnell just pulled up in his fly ass whip and I, I, it's making me uncomfortable. I need to know how much this nigga is making because he can't be making more than me. So um, now if you want to get yourself a new ride, you know, that's understandable. But just know that it might be some questions coming. So, you know, don't talk about price. Just say, oh, yeah, you know, I got it at a decent price. You know, uh, you know, I felt it was time for a new vehicle. But don't go into detail. Don't talk about prices, about nothing. Because uh, your coworkers are watching your pockets at all times. So uh, don't get too personal. Create boundaries in the workplace. And uh, your private social media is a boundary that you need to create. They'll give you more peace. You know, that's all we're looking for is peace on the job. So uh, I want to give you that little nugget. <clears throat> if you want to learn more, grab my book. The link is in my bio. All right. Appreciate it.